Okay, YouTube land. Um, I want to make a video just real quick. I want to talk about Never Seize. Wonderful product for automotive usage. Clothing nightmare. Now, this is a light gray. And it's lighter gray inside. This is a hooded sweatshirt. Um, these are the sort of things that if you're working in a building and it only gets you know you might be in areas where it gets down to 40 degrees because it's winter time and well swift drivers park trucks at docks uh, yeah you wear these sort of things inside so try to keep an extra one in the truck and uh i gave a guy that lived near the place i was working at a ride home and he gets in he just takes my jacket and tosses it in the back seat well i happen to have a box back there that had, had oil and chemicals in it and uh never sees because i stopped by the storage locker on the way to work and i grabbed some stuff out because i was going to do something else with my truck and the bottle never sees happened to be up near the top of the box and this sleeve on the inside got never sees on it as like a little line there where it contacted the cap area and like a little place there where it also contacted you'd see this side yeah it's not there and this is how the thing was in my truck with the sleeves inside out and this is the way i washed it too um sorry that is not the sleeve this is the sleeve okay you can see there's no dark gray spots and the never sees on here was a dark gray spot. Once I saw it on there, I put it someplace and left it be. You do not want to smear it around on the clothing. What you do, that's an older bottle that says Resolve, but the newer bottles, uh, they went back to the spray and wash logo. And I'm not endorsed by these people. I just use this product. If you get never sees on something like this, and like I said, on the inside where it's a, a lighter color, it really showed up. Um, I sprayed that on there. And I just used my thumbnail. But you can use a brush like this one and scrub that gently. Then take water and put it under water in the sink, the bathtub, garden hose. Uh, and you make sure you you get that out you use the spray and wash as your soap and you work that out and then you wash it you don't want that spray and wash with the never sees going into the washing machine because it might contaminate your other clothing um so i did that i made sure i washed it out let it air dry a bit so i could see that it was gone and then i put it in the washing machine with a load of laundry uh, my normal wash cycle, my normal all free clear laundry detergent. And you can see both sleeves on the inside. There is no never see spots. I mean, flip this around here. Yeah. This is the way it was in the truck, you know, with the sleeves inside out from the last time I'd worn it. And. Not even on the inside, not on the outside. Outside's a little bit dirtier because I've actually had to wear it from my truck wearing this before. That's just some fuzz uh, from what was in the dryer. But that's all you have to do to get never sees out of uh, your clothing. If you smear it around, it's harder to get out. And if it contacts other pieces of clothing, it becomes harder to get out. You don't want to spread the mess. You want to deal with the contaminated area um, and not transfer the contamination to your other clothes. Because some things is harder to get out of than others. Yet, I wanted to make a video and just show you guys on YouTube. Yeah, if you work on cars and you use NICs, there's ways to get the stuff out. And this stuff here, or the spray and wash, it was Resolve, then spray and wash, then actually it says spray and wash Resolve on there. Um, that stuff there 
works great for oily stains on clothes. Um, sometimes I use Cascade dishwasher soap uh, for heavily oiled product or garments, but uh, the spray and wash takes out oil. Uh, sometimes even after you've washed it something, you still have oil stains, you can spray and wash it at the next wash and get more of it out. Uh, so the stuff works. If you, like I said, if you work on cars, you will get stuff on you that it's a nightmare to get out. Um, don't don't hit the never seize with water first because that'll just set it. Hit it with that soap first and let it lift it off the fabric. If you have set it, just you might have to wash it a few or work it a few times. Um, things like RTV that takes. A couple washes to get off your clothes it's got to actually lift from the fabric um, but RTV as soon as it touches water it sets you know on your clothing so you got RTV on your pants you're smearing it all over and you just want to stop it from smearing put some cold water on it and you might be able to after a few months peel it off if not stop it from spreading all over like if you get a dab on your jacket you don't want to spread it all over the whole jacket uh, that's all for now. Just wanted to give you all a quick automotive laundry tip. Later, YouTube.